A man running for Congress in Minnesota has died. Adam Weeks was running in the 2nd District as the legal Marijuana Now Party candidate. His cause of death has not been released. As Susan Elizabeth Littlefield reports, his death means that votes in that race will not be counted and there will instead be a special election early next year. We are outside of the Dakota County Administration Center. We're told by election officials about 10,000 people have cast their votes here. Some of those votes won't count. Now, this is all, of course, because of the death of one of the candidates in the 2nd Congressional District. The Minnesota Secretary of State announced the death this afternoon and also what it means for the district. Secretary Steve Simon says the law is clear. If a major party nominee dies within 79 days of an election, a special election will be held. That special election is now slated for February 9th, 2021. That means any votes already cast in the District 2 race will not count, but votes cast for races like president, they will count. The second district includes South Metro communities of Prior Lake, Egan, Northfield, Cannon Falls, Zambroda, and the Hastings area where we are right now. Both candidates in District 2 were saddened to hear of Adam Weeks' death. Democratic Congresswoman Angie Craig says, Cheryl and I are praying for the Weeks family during this difficult time. Her Republican challenger, Tyler Kistner, says Adam was a passionate advocate for the causes he believed in, and he will be missed by all of those who knew him. Now, you're going to hear more on what the people who live in this district have to say, who maybe had already voted. We're going to have more on that coming up at 10 o'clock on WCCO. The legal marijuana now party gained major party status in 2018 when one of the party's candidates for state office received more than 5% of the vote. If the party was not considered a major party, the special election would not need to happen.